The United Nations has condemned the killing of pro-democracy protesters by Egypt's military rulers. Its human rights chief called the use of force excessive and demanded an independent investigation. Crowds in Cairo and other Egyptian cities want the army to stand down now and be replaced with an interim civilian government. Many have gathered at the capital's Tahrir Square, repeating scenes from the revolution that forced ex-president Hosni Mubarak to stand down in February. Tear gas has been used to break up the demonstrations, but activists say the police are also firing live rounds. The clashes broke out at the weekend. At least 37 people have died and nearly 2,000 have been injured. Parliamentary elections begin Monday, but demonstrators want a presidential poll to be held afterwards. They fear the army is trying to buy time to protect its political and economic interests so it can retain a say in how Egypt is governed in the future.